when to use a hypothesis test for paired population means. Statistics students often ask, what statistical method should I be using to analyze these data or to answer this question? In particular, you may be wondering if a hypothesis test for paired population means, sometimes called a paired t-test, is appropriate for the question and data you have. This hypothesis test is used when you have a single population, but two separate measurements for the group. Furthermore, the characteristic of these groups that you are measuring is quantitative, that is numerical, and you want to know if the averages or means of the two measurements are the same or different. Here are some examples in which a test for paired population means can be used. Note the different ways in which the questions can be asked. Example 1. Is there evidence of a difference in the average pretest and the average post-test scores of a group of students? Example 2. Can you prove that the mean weekly sales in dollars for a group of local chain stores is greater after a new logo is launched than before? Example 3. Test the claim that the mean rating in number of stars of two movies is the same when each movie is rated by the same group of 10 movie critics. In each of these examples, there are four common characteristics. First, we have a single group that we investigate. That is, one set of students, one group of stores, and one group of movie critics. Second, there are two measurements for each group, both a pretest and a post-test score for the students, sales both before and after the new logo, and ratings for two movies given by the same critics. Third, the measurements are quantitative. For example, test scores, sales in dollars, and number of stars are all numerical. Fourth, we are examining the mean or average of the two measurements to see if there is evidence of a difference. When these four qualities are present, a hypothesis test for paired population means is appropriate. Created using Powtoon.